Uh, so good evening all, and tonight's session, tonight's webinar for CIS 205 is CompTIA certification versus test out certification. Now, before we can do that, we got to talk about why should you get certified. Um, so one of the first things that we talk about when you get certified is it should, if you're going for just a general certification, uh, it should be given by an independent third party. And why you should get certified? Well, because the certifications are easily verifiable. And if you're a business owner or you are interviewing somebody for a position or a contract, uh, certifications are easier than testing an applicant on your own. They also show that there is a base that you can build upon to, to provide that knowledge or that technical specialty training for the position that you're hiring for. And for you, the certificate holder, it basically proves that you know what you know. So what are some of the benefits of certification? Well, they can help you land a job because it proves that you know what you know. Uh, certifications can help you advance within a position. So normally I try and stay away from anecdotal uh, stories and whatnot, but sometimes you just got to. Uh, a friend of mine was Tier 1 tech support for Snohomish County for their uh, CIS department. And in order for him to advance beyond Tier 1, he actually had to get his A-plus certification to advance beyond Tier 1. Um, he is now Tier 2. And so instead of sitting behind a desk all day fielding phone calls from people who's, who can't operate their PCs correctly, now what he's doing is he is building physical servers and virtual servers and provisioning virtual servers and taking care of both the physical and the, and the VMs for our department yet of Snohomish County. Uh, they increased his rate of pay from Tier 1 to Tier 2 by almost 27% was the jump in pay grade for him. And that's all because he got his A-plus certification. Uh, certifications can also help you in reaching your educational goals. Uh, some certifications are recognized by uh, other institutions. Uh, one of the main ones that I personally know about is WGU, since they are a competency-based program, and the way you can evaluate competency a lot of the times is through third-party verification. Uh, also, if you're... It used to be, I, I haven't verified this in a while, but it used to be if you wanted to become a Microsoft certified um, or get your MSCA or MSCE certification from Microsoft, uh, they allowed A plus and Network Plus to substitute for some of their tests. And having taken some Microsoft tests, I much prefer CompTIA's over Microsoft's. So they will help you do that as well. So now let's kind of talk about CompTIA versus test out. Um, my personal position is, is that CompTIA is the better of the two. I know it costs you guys a little bit more money to to take. Uh, the CompTIA exams, that which one's better? I ran a search on Indeed.com uh, looking for positions that required both CompTIA certification and those that are required the test out certification. 
Indeed.com had 3,253 positions that required CompTIA certification. But there were zero on Indeed.com that required test out certification. So why is CompTIA better? Well, CompTIA has been around since 1983. Uh, they weren't called CompTIA back then. Uh, they were actually, their, their letters and their name were ABCD, and I can't remember what that acronym stood for. Uh, but that, that organization morphed into CompTIA, and the A-plus certification has actually been around since, in, since 1993. Um, since 1993, they have changed the test continually to uh, look at or to keep, keep pace with technology. Uh, another reason why CompTIA, I, I do believe, is the better uh, certification to take is you should look at uh, these two web links that I have here. You might want to copy those down, or you can send me an email, and I'll send you the links directly. Uh, the top one right there, the one that's uh, from CompTIA, will show you a list of, of employers, big employers, that actually require uh, CompTIA certification. And they'll even show you some of the certifications that they require. Another uh, little bit more objective standard is that bottom link. That's an article that's on Tom's Hardware. Uh, for those of you who don't know Tom's Hardware, you should you should check it out. It's kind of an interesting site, um, full of uh, yeah. I'll let you explore it on your own. But that article right there uh, ran through a list of the best uh, certifications to have and they broke it out by essentially job title and industry, or kind of industry. And CompTIA showed up on almost every list. Test out never did. And finally, the best reason why you should do the CompTIA certification actually, in my opinion, comes from test out themselves. Because test out specifically states that it prepares the student for the CompTIA certification. So if they actually felt that their certification was better, it probably wouldn't tell you that, um, they probably wouldn't tell you that they specifically train you for the CompTIA exams. So, now for my standard speech. Um, not my span standard speech, but my standard thing. So you're, you're going after a contract. You've decided that you're going to um, do your own, own business. You're going to do technical support for small businesses. Now, you're going after a contract. I'm going after a contract. Uh, you have, we have roughly the same amount of experience, uh, but you don't have any any industry certifications that I do. As a matter of fact, here's the list of the current certifications that I hold. Now, I may cost more money uh, because of my certifications. But who do you think they're going to have more confidence in, me or you? And that's kind of a rhetorical question. Um, now, who's playing with my stuff? Um, but that, 
but that is one of the advantages or the main advantage to having certifications. It can help you land a job. It can help you land a contract. It's easy for people to verify your certifications. All of those people have um, the opportunity to to verify what you have. So now I'm going to now I'm going to close the recording and I will take questions just from anything. So hold on a sec.